bottom. Yeah, so he still got three pounds. It's nine ten in the morning. Probably less now. I've been leaking. Yeah, um, we're gonna get him in the blankets. You guys saw a little bit yesterday, but I'll try to forget more. Like I said, he's in good spirits, but he's it's been a little bit rough, so I don't want to have a camera on his face. Um, but yeah, just a little update. It's nine in the morning. Thursday morning, he's about to have his weight cut, official weight cuts at 12 p.m. I get you, and I know why you're like that. I don't blame you. It's not your fault. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Now you gotta prove everybody wrong here in California. Fuck everybody. <sighs> it's your time, Danny's time. It's always been everybody else's time, but yours. The emotions, like the physical part of the weight cuts, hard, but the emotions of a weight cut are way harder. I can do physical all day, but it's like I try so hard to be a positive person and I get so irritated when I'm hungry and I can't like control it, it pisses me off that I can't control it. Uh. Oh, that was more water. I bet your tears are heavy. This is Andy Hall from the BKFC. My guy, this is my connection. This guy's helped me with everything that I've needed him to help me with. The one and only guy in the whole BKFC to do that. So thank you, Andy. Let's go, baby. Oh. <laughs> you know, California ass and we Bare knuckle 
fighting record of one victory opposite a single defeat from Manchester, Connecticut, by way of Lake Elsinore, California. house to go eat some roast. This little piggy needs to eat. Huh? You hungry? Fucking know. starving to death. But yeah guys everything went smooth. Um, obviously you guys saw earlier me at my worst point. I haven't felt like that literally since I was like withdrawing off of like bad stuff. That's what it that's what it reminded me of and I think that's why it was so hard for me was because it was giving me flashbacks of a past that I try so hard to forget and uh, yeah but anyway we did our best I worked hard for the weight I didn't just fucking not try like we really we really worked hard she even worked hard on my weight cut like without her I wouldn't have even gotten to 146.6 it was bad, like, I was so dry that we went upstairs for a whole hour and I only got .1 out of me. And I was in the sauna and the, I don't even understand how that's possible. Huh? He said, to, he's like, fuck, you gotta pay him 20%. I was like, yeah. And he's like, whatever, just knock him out and get the KO bonus. Same thing we said. He's like, now you have to get it. So he's scared. He was like, bro, he's fucking scared. I can see it in his eyes. He's fucking terrified of you. Use that to your advantage and smash this motherfucker. What up, California? It is fight day, baby. And look at our beautiful view of the parking structure. So, cool story. I used to build these. Before I fought, before I climbed, I used to do parking structures. That's actually how I got into telecom. Long story short, they wanted a civil foreman on a telecom crew, or in a telecom company. So I became a civil foreman, did concrete and stuff in telecom, and then I went into the RF side. That's how I got into telecommunications, was parking structures. All right. Fight day vibes, we're going down to the beat, uh, gym, then we're going to go to the pool, relax. Um, oh, you know what? I should probably be wearing Rebel Coffee's hat, huh? No, I'm wearing the fucking Mexico hat. I'm sorry, Rebel Coffee, but I got to rock this today. I got to be a Mexican today. Are you... Tiny. That's it's the so 16 footer. You ready? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Even
Trying an oyster. Cheers. It's good, huh? Good. <laughs>